The What's Next project is for 14 to 18 year olds and I do a mixture of group work and one-to-one -one with um, young people with a variety of different learning disabilities who need a lot of help to communicate the basic things about their day-to-day -day lives, let alone big decisions like what do you want to happen when you leave school. This is Sam. Sam is our mascot for the charity that I work for, Swinton Advocacy. Young people sometimes find it easier to talk through the puppet and talk about big changes or big steps that they want to take as if Sam wants to rather than I want to, because it's a bit less scary. Ben's thing was to be a DJ, and here we are, <laughs> four years later, he's a DJ. Hi Ben, uh, how are you doing? Age. Just talking to John about the programme today. Okay. So John, Ben's going to be talking about his new feature on Motown music. Okay. You okay with that? Yeah. Brilliant. Have fun. I come here once a week and it's helped me in the way of learning to do travelling on the bus. It, it brightens my day up a bit and it's good to see everybody because when I come in everybody will be saying morning to me and how I've been and ask what I've been up to. And it's more... Um, respectful. We wrote to the radio station and we had the phone call with Shirley and we arranged a meeting and for as much of that as possible I supported Ben to do that so it's not just me doing it on his behalf he had to do it. Ben came in and met us and it was absolutely delightful great sense of humour sometimes uh, he does say that he is the station manager which is great gives me a day off um, but he quickly became part of the team and learnt his skills in recording, editing. His first interview was with the Mayor of Swindon, and I think he's a living testimony to how people can do things if they really want to. OK, Ben, you're on air in five minutes. OK. Good morning, Ben. How are you good doing? Good morning. Yeah, I'm doing good, thank you. When the station opened in 2008, I, I started listening to the Motown shows. And, um, you've got into, you've really got into your Motown now, haven't you? Yes, yeah, so it got me in a good mood for when I listened to it. So do you want to introduce the song that we're going to play now? OK, this is Martha and the Van Der Rez dancing in the street. Before I met Kat, I was a bit quiet, like, because I didn't know how to speak out. It couldn't have been more successful. It's had a huge, wild impact on him in terms of his confidence and what he wants to do next. I want to hopefully try and get out a bit more, meet friends and start going places instead of keep saying no all the time. Last year, 138 were involved in the project. We've received 95,000 from children in need previously and were lucky enough to be successful in reapplying. So we're now continuing for another three years. Yeah.